Good morning everyone, my name is Ruba Hending Flores and for today we will discuss the Infinite Series. The Power Series to be specific. The objective is to understand the definition of a power series, find the regions and the interval of convergence of a power series, determine the endpoint convergence of a power series, and differentiate and integrate a power series. So given this power series, an important function f of x is equal to a raised to x can be represented exactly by the infinite series, called a power series. For example, the power series representation for a raised to x is a raised to x is equal to 1 plus x plus x squared all over 2 factorial plus x cubed all over 3 factorials plus so on as x is equal to raised to n and then it will be equal to over to n factorial. For each real number x, it can be shown that the infinite series on the right converges to the number of a raised to x. Definition of power series. If x is a variable, then an infinite series of the form the summation of to the n rest, uh, um, in sub n x raised to n and as, as n is, is equal to 0 and then approaches the infinity then it would be equal to 0 sub z, a sub 0 plus a sub 1 x plus x a sub 2 x squared plus a 3 a sub 3 x cubed and so on is called a power series more generally an infinite series of the form the summation of a sub n a quantity of x minus c raised to n as n is equal to 0 and infinity is equal to 0 a sub 0 plus a sub 1 quantity of x minus c plus a sub 2 quantity of x minus c squared so on as it approaches a sub n quantity of x minus c raised to n and so on. It's called a power series centered at c where c is n constant. Example, the following power series is centered at zero. So we came up with this x raised to n all over n factorial is equal to 1 plus x plus x squared all over 2 factorial plus x cubed all over 3 factorial and so on. The following series is centered at negative 1. So we came up with negative 1 raised to n x quantity of x plus 1 raised to n is equal to 1 minus x plus 1 plus the quantity of x plus 2 squared minus x plus 1 cubed plus and so on. For the following series is centered at x1. So we have 1 over n quantity of x minus 1 raised to n is equal to the quantity of x minus 1 plus 1 half quantity of x plus 1 minus squared plus 1 over 3 the quantity of x minus 1 cubed and so on. The radius and interval of convergence. The radius and interval of convergence, a power series in x can be viewed as a function of x. So we have this a function of x, the summation of a sub n, the quantity of x minus c raised to n, where n is equal to 0 and each approaches to infinity. Where the domain of f is the set of all x for which the power series converges, of course, every power series converges at its center c because f of c is equal to a sub n quantity of c minus c raised to n as n as approaches is equal to 0 approaches to infinity so we have this 0 sub n 1 plus 0 plus 0 plus 0 and so on so we came up with a sub 0 so c always lies in the domain of f the theorem 9.20 to the follow states that the domain of a power series can take three basic forms of a single point, an interval centered at C or the entire real number line as shown in the figure 9.15. Just observe in a figure and let's proceed. The theorem 9.20 converges of our sign series for our star centered at C precisely of the one following is true. The series converges only at C. There exists a real number R is greater than zero such that the series converges absolutely with this absolute value of x minus c which is less than by r and diverges for the absolute value of x minus c as greater than r. The series converges absolutely for x, the number r in the radius of the convergence of the power series. If this, if this series converges only at c, then then the radius of convergence is r is equal to 0. If the series converges for all x, then the radius of convergence 
is r is equal to infinity, the set of all values of x for which the power series converges in the integral of convergence of the power series. And that will be all. Don't worry, I will be posting another videos talks about power series. Thank you.